Good day, good day! How the hunk are ya? <laughs> this is your friend Dan-O, and welcome to Roverland. This is a channel that's all about anything and everything Land Rover. Right now we're going through my uh, toy collection, and right now I want to just remind you all out there, keep calm and carry on during these hard times. Yeah, that's right. We're going to get back out there again. Don't worry. All right. Uh, today we're going to take a look at a couple of cars that I found and uh, quite a unique little uh, set of cars. Uh, I actually found two of them and uh, this is a story. Uh, as you all know, I'm in Wisconsin and I live near the Dells, Wisconsin Dells. Uh, I, I actually living in uh, the shop here. Roverland is in Nesita, and Wisconsin Dells is a big tourist, the water park capital of the world. Anyway, I uh, was um, dated this girl for a while, and her favorite shop was Cracker Barrel. So I would take her out to Cracker Barrel, or we would go out to Cracker Barrel. Sometimes she'd buy, sometimes I'd buy. I'm going to tell you the truth. But anyway, days gone by. Probably won't ever get back there again. <laughs> but anyway, they have a toy store, or a, a, a shop inside the restaurant. So C Cracker Barrel, if you're not familiar with it, is an old country-style restaurant that, uh, you know, biscuits and gravy... You know, cut green beans, uh, uh, just kind of old home style cooking, you know, country fried steak, stuff like that. And uh, so anyway, they have a gift shop outside, when the, which they probably make quite a bit of money and uh, off of that. And it's got clothing, it's got knickknacks, it's got uh, all kinds of stuff. Uh, candy, novelty candies, and pop, and stuff like that. I always like picking up the pops. Someday I'll tell you about my uh, love for a little uh, good old good old sarsaparilla. But anyway, back to the story. Uh, they got a toy section, and uh, one of the things that you know uh, Cracker Barrel does is you know their touristy area and stuff like that. So you go in there, mom and pops can buy some kind of stuff. And they got toys in there, so if you're traveling. You can buy something for the kids. All right, so that's where we come with this. So I found a couple of these there. Awesome. So let's take a look at it. As, as you notice, this is a police a vehicle, dial 911. That's an American thing. Uh, police car, city police, uh, kind of a generic uh, uh, badge logo there. Uh, very neat. It does kind of the they do kind of have a pearl pearl essence white paint job uh, and uh, it got the panoramic. This has got to be a uh, Land Rover Evoque. There is no uh, badging or anything like that, but this is a two door Land Rover Evoque. Not sure really <laughs> if there'd be any police departments that would use that, but anyway, let's take a flip over here and let's take a look at it. This is made in China. And uh, now you see that it is distributed by Mobile Essel, uh, Essentials, LLC, uh, from Holman, Wisconsin. So this sticker has nothing to do with the model, okay? <laughs> so this company buys these in mass quantities, and then they distribute them to um, different places like, like Cracker Barrel, all right? So that really doesn't give us any hint there at all. And the only other hint we have is that it is made in China. Now, you notice that it does have a little doodad for uh, batteries. We're going to get to that. Hold on to that thought. But these are pullback toys. Yeah, they are pullback toys. And I just about drove that right off the desk. <laughs> So there you go. So they are pullback toys, so they are kind of uh, neat. And the doors do open. These are left hookers, so they're once again an American uh, type thing. And we are not getting any kind of shot in there of the interior. It's just totally dark in there. I don't know if there's any way that we can kind of get that to 
to really zoom in there but it's nicely detailed uh, right now the uh, steering wheel is kind of all the way upside down but it's got uh, nice seats in there it's got the stick shift in there uh, all kinds of nice stuff black interior um, so both doors open very nice it's got the panel on the inside of the door which is kind of nice so you know it's got a door paneling there very very kind of neat um, the other thing um, is it does have lens inserts for the headlight the bottom base which is plastic comes up and kind of finishes off the bottom balance there that's kind of nice but the rest is uh, die cast you know the doors are die cast uh, the main body is die cast we get around to the back here we have got the lens details again for the uh, rear tail lights no other uh, decoing here uh, but just the deco on the side this is not really a standard uh, land, um, standard police <laughs> decoing really uh, that's not really uh, kind of the way we do things around here but <laughs> but uh, then uh, the wheels the wheels are pretty uh, nice they are rubber uh, that which is kind of nice being that it's a pullback um, so these are pretty neat now I do they are a little wonk though <laughs> if you notice those rear wheels are a little bit out further than the front well the front has got some play in them you know those are kind of bogus but these back wheels being that they're uh, pullback um, do do kind of sit outside the uh, wheel wells there a little bit you can't really see it too much from the top so maybe it's just an optical illusion uh, I know this one is really kind of got one that kind of really sits out you can see that really kind of sits out of the uh, the wheel well there so it's kind of nice I like to pick these up yes I did pay $7.99 for these um, just because uh, they were there I didn't have to pay for shipping <laughs> I went, I, I went once and I found one and then I had to go back uh, uh, like a month or something later and then I found another one which was uh, totally, totally awesome. Uh, the light bar on top, I have recognized that light bar from other places so they just honk and just take that and uh, just plunk that on top. Yeah, they go right, right in there. It's held on by two, uh, two pegs there. So, um, and matter of fact, I know that they're not really built for this uh, because they're two different sizes and they're opposite of each other. Yeah, this one's got the red on the left and blue on the right, and this one's got blue on the right and the red on the, or blue on the left and right. <laughs> you got it, okay? And they're so, they're totally different. So, um, yeah, they, they're not really... Yeah, they were just made into squad cars by somebody. But, uh, so there you go. I got those two buggers. Very, very nice. All right, wait. There's part two of the story. And, uh, yeah, here it is. Part two. Look at this guy. So one of the times that I went back is, uh, <laughs> I found this guy. Now, totally different per se, but the same. Uh, the bases are a little bit different. Uh, the, the marking on there is just a little bit different. Not, not really too much. But anyway, uh, I guess they're the same. I guess that printing is the same. Yeah. Uh, once again, it has the battery operated. I did have to put new batteries in there uh, because they, are, uh, they were uh, worn out. Now this one really does have a wonk wheel. That really hangs out on this one. And there's not really much you can do about it because it is a pullback. So there you go. Same identical model per se as the other ones, except for look at those wheels. Those are really nice. Very nice wheels on there. And it's the front that activates the siren now this one um i i i think i had to pay 7.99 because that's what the wad of the cars are but this one was different i knew it was different and i had to have it anyway uh that's a little bit more than what i like to pay but uh hey it was uh pretty much a full car 
Uh, I didn't have to pay for shipping, but it does have damage. As you see, here's where they just uh, oh, wrecked the model by putting on some, <laughs> I don't know who wants <laughs> lights on a glass, but anyway, that's how they did it. They just burnt some, uh, melted some holes in there and put lights on that bugger. And uh, same deco and everything. Now this one does have a busted out um, headlight, which was the uh, you know the light insert, which was pretty pretty cool. And it does have an extra couple of neat things because this I think is a higher end model because it does have the lights and sounds, or I shouldn't say lights, the sounds. I'm not sure if it had lights or not, but the the uh, the front end is a little bit different. This has got the uh, all solid, um, and this has got like a plastic insert that snaps onto, you can see the white uh, metal behind it, and that kind of snaps on there. So um, so it is different, but it's, it's the same. Uh, boy, oh boy, the casting on the rear <laughs> mag there looks uh, pretty, pretty well, yeah, I need to clean that out. But otherwise, it uh, yeah, it's uh, virtually the same vehicle, and uh, but not. So it's kind of nice to have that variation. But um, if I really now, but also the other thing I should mention is that, and I'm going to say that this one here is um, the earlier model, I guess. Um, and I don't know if you can really tell it there on the camera, but this one here, the for a higher end one with the lights and sound or the sound and action is a little bit more pearlescence if you could see that but uh yeah there you go so very interesting have you got some of these have you come across these these are um they get i'm i'm sure it's one of those kind of things where they get them in trays of nine or twelve and they're meant for uh you know walgreens and and high-end stores i know um Kmart used to sell this kind of stuff, kind of like, kind of like uh, Kingsmart or a Welly pullback. Uh, they, I think they targeted that. Uh, RMZ maybe. Uh, I'm not sure. If somebody knows, let me know in the comments down below what what maker this is. All I've got to go on is uh, made in China. So really neat. I like them. Uh, maybe this one I'll I'll redo because it's damaged. Uh, I don't know, but uh, for right now I'm very happy with it, like it is. All right, that's gonna be it for today. Make sure you uh, give me a big thumbs up. Look at that big thumb. Yeah, give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe. Tell your friends and family about me. Uh, spread the word. We're growing as a channel. Thank you very much, you guys, for all that you guys do for me commenting down below and and uh, coming over to Facebook that the Facebook page is growing so make sure you want to join uh, the Facebook Roverland and as well uh, Instagram check that out Roverland channel alrighty that's going to be it for today remember oh especially when the cops are looking slow traffic keep left or no 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 Let's put the slow traffic to the right. That's right. Slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day.